integration testing what is integration testing integration testing is the phase of software testing in which the individual software modules are combined and tested as a group the purpose of this testing is to verify functional performance and reliability of the product how does integration testing fit into the software development life cycle even if a software component is successfully unit tested in an enterprise entire distributed application it is of little or no value if the component cannot be successfully integrated with the rest of the application once unit tested components are delivered we then integrate them together these integrated components are tested to find out errors and bugs caused due to the integration this is a very important step in the software development life cycle it is possible that different programmers developed different components a lot of bugs emerge during the integration step in most cases a dedicated testing team focuses on integration testing prerequisites for integration testing before we begin integration testing it is important that all the components have been successfully unit tested integration testing steps step 1 create a test plan step 2 create test cases and test data step 3 if applicable create scripts to run test cases step 4 once the components have been integrated execute the test cases step 5 fix the bugs if any and retest the code step 6 repeat the test cycle until the components have been successfully integrated what is an integration test plan This document describes the test plan in other words how the tests will be carried out. This will typically include the list of things to be tested, roles and responsibility, prerequisites to begin testing, test environment, assumptions, what to do after a test is successfully carried out, what to do if test fails, glossary and so on. What is an integration test case? Simply put, A test case describes exactly how the test should be carried out. The integration test cases specifically focus on the flow of data or information or control from one component to the other. So the integration test cases should typically focus on scenarios where one component is being called from another. Also the overall application functionality should be tested to make sure the application works when the different components are brought together. The various integration test cases club together form an integration test suite each suite may have particular focus in other words different test suites may be created to focus on different areas of the application as a dedicated testing team may be created to execute the integration test cases therefore the integration test cases should be as detailed as possible steps for effective integration testing software configuration management automate build process where necessary document and defect tracking let us go through this one by one software configuration management since integration testing focuses on integration of components and components can be built by different developers and even different development teams it is important the right version of components are tested this may sound very basic but the biggest problem faced in entire development is integrating the right version of components integration testing may run through several iterations and to fix bugs components may undergo changes hence it is important that a good software configuration management policy is in place we should be able to track the components and their versions so each time we integrate the application components we know exactly what versions go into the build process automate build process where necessary a lot of errors occur because the wrong version of components were sent for the build or there are missing components if possible write a script to integrate and deploy the components this helps reduce manual errors document document the integration process or build process to help eliminate the errors of omission or oversight it is possible that the person responsible for integrating the components forgets to run a required script and the integration testing will not yield correct results defect tracking integration testing will lose its edge 
if the defects are not tracked correctly. Each defect should be documented and tracked. Information should be captured as to how the defect was fixed. This is valuable information. It can help in future integration and development processes. Summary Integration testing is the most crucial steps in the software development lifecycle. Different components are integrated together and tested. This can be a daunting task in enterprise applications where diverse teams build different models and components.